The question before the country is to decide whether the Southeast is a critical part of Nigeria and has become an accepted part of our nation. If so, there is no basis for anybody to argue that we, you cannot zone to the Southeast, neither in APC or PDP. When we zone to the Southwest, PDP did not win in the Southwest. We got no, less than 10% of the, 15% of the votes in the Southwest in, two, in 1999. So not being able to get votes in Southeast does not preclude APC from doing what is right, which is building national consensus. We have to build this nation. Once we build this nation, if the two parties present two Igbo candidates, I can tell you, the question will now be, what do these people have to offer to the country? The argument will shift from where they come from to what they have to bring to the table. But once we default our fault lines of a southern and northern presidency, then the argument changes. The conversation becomes almost a case of identity politics. So I think it is in the best interest of the country to continue that tradition. 1999, two Yoruba people, we chose the Yoruba man we wanted. 2007, two northerners, we chose the northerner we wanted, President Yaradua. In 2011, that trajectory broke, unfortunately because of the death of President Yaradua. And I'm saying that the time has come for us to revert back to it because in 2019, we went back to it, two Northerners. We presented them and the Nigerians chose the Northerner they wanted. So this is the time to present two Igbo people. Let the Nigerians choose the Igbo man they want. Let the argument be about their competence and what they are bringing to the table.